Hey, what's going on, everybody? Hope you guys are doing great. Happy Friday. Got four matchups I do like on the slate today. It's a pretty small slate. I honestly hate it. I mean, there's some of the probably the worst games, so it's very tough. But I did find a few that I, I do find intriguing here. But um, yeah, go ahead and like and subscribe. You guys already know what to do. Check out all my betting links in the description below. And if you guys like betting on college basketball player props, go ahead and check out Parlay Play. Get five free entries when you guys sign up. Go ahead and take advantage. Hopefully you can get some nice wins as we head into this uh, pretty action-packed weekend. And um, yeah, we'll hop in it here. Uh, four matchups that I do like, starting with Southern Illinois versus Drake. Drake opening up as a three-point home favorite with the over-under at 127. The last 10 head-to-head, -head, Drake is 7-3. and three. Five and five covering the spread. The overs hit in four out of the last 10 matchups. These teams did just play each other. Drake won that matchup by a two points, so definitely a tight game. Probably expect another tight game as well. Um, Drake coming into this on a five-game winning streak, playing pretty good here. Pretty much in the month of February, they've been pretty solid. Um, or the second half of February, uh, SIU. They're just one and four in their last five against Drake. Uh Drake 5 and 0 against the Missouri Valley Conference. Um 4 and 1 covering on a Friday. Only a 3 point spread. They beat them by 2. That's why maybe the spread scares me a little bit, but um I like Drake money line at home. Uh already beat Southern Illinois. Now they get a chance at home. Um give me the Bulldogs at home here. Next matchup, we have Richmond versus St. Bonaventure. St. Bonaventure opening up as a three and a half point home favorite with the over under at 138. The last three head to head, uh, St. Bonaventure two and one, two and one covering the spread. The overs hit in one out of the last three matchups. Uh, these teams did play each other early February. Richmond did pick up a 10 point win in that matchup. Um, uh, Richmond coming off a tough two point Dayton loss. Bonaventure coming off a very bad VCU loss, losing 74 to 51. Uh, that was definitely, definitely a shocker uh, for them to lose that game. Uh, Richmond eight and three covering the spread on the road. St. Bonaventure uh, five and one at home against Richmond. This is going to be a battle here. Uh, you know, Richmond won by double digits in the last meeting. Very important game here as we pretty much most of these games are pretty much ending this ending people's seasons as we head into. Uh, tournament play and uh then into march madness here i like richmond plus three and a half on the road i mean this is a very even even matchup about oh, team richmond 19 and 11 st bonaventure 19 and 8 richmond beat them by 10 the last time i know road and home games are are drastically different and uh but i think it's going to be a close game here i like the plus three and a half with richmond Next matchup, we have Ohio versus Northern Illinois. Ohio opening up as a nine and a half point road favorite with the over under at 137 and a half. The last 10 head to head Ohio is six and four in those head to head meetings. Ohio, they've been struck one and three in their last four. This is a really good Ohio team, but they've just had a rough, rough couple games here. Uh, they did beat NIU, I think by like 14, 15 points in their last meeting. NIU on a five game losing streak. They've definitely had a rough two and eight in their last 10. They've had a rough uh, March and February so far. Ohio uh, 13 and six against NIU. NIU 0 and eight at home. I mean, that definitely hurts. I like Ohio here. They've been slumping on a two game losing streak. I like them to bounce back. Minus nine and a half. Not in love with it. They did beat them by double digits in their last meeting. Maybe throw Ohio in a teaser, but I definitely do like them in your money line parlays on the road here. So uh, we're going to take Ohio on the road. And then the last matchup, we have Utah State versus San Jose State. Utah State opening up as a 13-point road favorite with the over-under at 137 and a half. The last 10 head-to-head -head, Utah State is 9-1. Six and four covering the spread. The overs hit in six out of the last 10 matchups. Uh, yeah, Utah State, they're one and five in their last six. 
San Jose State, they're one and nine in their last 10. I mean, San Jose State's a very bad team. Utah State, they're they are a pretty decent team, but they just they've had a rough they had a rough second half of February. Uh, these teams did play early February. Utah State winning that matchup by 16 points. Utah State 11 and 1 on the road against San Jose. San Jose State 1 and 16 in their last 17. They really can't buy a win right now. 1 and 7 at home. Give me Utah State minus 13. Throw them in your parlays and teasers. Get that total down. And you should already know. Money lines first always. I never bet on spreads unless I throw them in a teaser. So bet with your spread at um with caution but um we're rolling with the aggies on the road here and that's gonna be it for the video good luck with your picks and parlays on friday hope you guys all cash out and i'll see you guys saturday have a good one